she get we have to get that front leg forward a little bit more. Yep, more get step. her squared up. Come on, one more step. Hi guys. We have the mammoth back out working with her feet. Yesterday I did six minutes per foot. And today I'm gonna decrease it and do two minutes per foot. And sometimes that can really help them have more soak time. They're not a fan of a lot of repetitiveness, so our goal being just to simply get her comfortable. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one, deep. When we say deep, she gets oats. Lick her back foot more square. So I'm gonna ask her with my hand to back up. She leaned, I released the pressure. There, she's more square. Ready? Foot. So now I'm just holding my hand on her leg. Keeping myself away from her back feet. And now I'm just going to wait for it. She doesn't know what I want. She stepped forward with the wrong foot. I want her to pick up this foot or go on the toe would be ideal. I'm going to guide her forward a little bit and help her. Oh, wrong foot. You can do it. You can do it. Feet. Good girl. Good job. Good for you. Good for you. Now almost two minutes has gone by already. <laughs> two minutes is going to be too too little of time. I think so. Two minutes might be. Oh, she's getting ready to give you that foot again. I'm going to reset this timer. It's okay. two minutes. We were only able to ask her a question two times. Ready? Now she's not very square with that back end. I'm going to ask her to back up her back left there. That's good. A little bit more. Good girl. Good girl. Ready? <coughs> foot. Oh, 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 almost, almost. Deep. Good girl. There, she stayed on her toe for a second. That mm -hmm. was nice. You know, Good she really girl. is, she's just unsure what you're asking. She's going to be pretty excited when she figures out, oh, you want me to do that. You will be. I never did reset the timer. Okay, I'm going to change this to three minutes. And we'll go to her back foot. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one, deep. Again, when I say deep, Dan's going to give her oats. Ready? Her ears are, she's looking back. Foot. I'm looking for her to take weight off. She just took weight off. Foot. Deep. Good girl. Good job. Good girl. No kick out yesterday when I was off camera. She did kick backwards a little bit, but I think it was like, what do you want? Oh. Well, and if she's used to us doing it as a team, and then if we're doing it without a right. team, that can that can affect things. Well, there's no aggression. It was more like, what do you want? Is this good? Is this it? Right. Yeah. And with Dan up front, with the halter, if she were to go to kick, he would be able to turn her towards me to get her feet away from me. Ready? Foot. I'm just waiting for it. I'm not grabbing. I'm not squeezing. Yeah, she's I'm watching. Grabbing. See what you're doing. She's like, what are you doing back there? Yeah, that's mom. Foot. 
You can do it. I know you can. Sweeting so going on. Weight off. Good girl. So as soon as she started to take off the weight, I relaxed my hand. She's on her toe right now. So I'm going to rub her and say deep. And you're going to oat the whole Let time. That's the oats fly? Yeah. Deep, 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 deep. Again, she's on her toe. Fortunately, I don't think the camera can see it very well there. A little bit better. I'm going to do it again. Yeah. And I might bounce it. We'll see. I, tell yeah, me how she's cool. doing. I'm jiggling it. I'm not taking it off the ground. She moved it a little bit for me. Ooh, that was really good. Wow, good job. Good job. So again, the purpose of going this slow is simply to help her be comfortable with us around her feet. And in the long run, to build, not rush it, and build a solid, rock-solid foundation. Right. So the three-minute timer is going. However, she's still on her toe. Thank you. I'm going to rub her leg some more. She says she wouldn't mind a little bit more oats. I'm gonna jiggle it. Good girl! Holy moly, good job! Good job! Good girl, you did a good job. Yeah, good job. Mm -hmm. Good for you. Good for you. There, she just went back onto her foot. She got off her toe. So now we'll switch and do the other side. I'm not seeing any stress movements. Nope. She's just... She's not swishing her tail. Her lips are not tight. <laughs> that pine could be stress. Or she wants you to hurry up and do that leg. We already did both sides on here. You got to turn her. Okay, come on. Let's get turned around. Come on. Oh, you're so, not so graceful, huh? Not so graceful. Here you go. Good girl. Good job. Good job. We might be able to do it like this now. Yeah, it's looking good from here. I can see. All right. Cool beans. That was either stress or she's like excited to do that foot. Yeah, probably stress. So sometimes just letting them have soaking time. They might start licking and chewing. They could let out big breaths. Or sometimes if we take a big breath, it can help them. I've seen them do it right after I do it. And sometimes it takes them a little bit of time before they actually let all of that out. I'm going with she was excited. <laughs> all right. Ready? Find out. She's pretty square right now. Five, four, three, two, one, deep. And yes, if she wanted to, she could kick and make contact with me where I'm standing. I'm not 100% safe where I'm at. But this is the best I can do. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one, deep. I'm going to set that timer on my watch for three minutes. Ready? I'm going to rub my hand down and then just set my hand there. There she took her weight off deep. Good girl. Hopefully I wasn't blocking all of that. Good girl. Ready? If she were to turn her head away from me when I say that, then she's definitely not ready. Foot. 
Dean. Good girl. Good girl. That was nice. Mm -hmm. Pretty chill. I don't know if she would even be willing to leave herself on her toe right now with how jagged her front are. I agree. The foot's pretty rough. We did call the vet, and we're talking about putting her, what's the contraption called? Just in a rack. In a rack where they can sedate her and then have their farrier come out and trim her. That way we just have more time to do this without feeling rushed. So our normal farrier is coming in eight days. I don't see her ready to be just flat out trimmed. And we don't want to make her wait for another two months. Right. This is urgent. It needs to be done sooner than later. Ready? Foot. Dean. Good girl. Good job. Nice work. Pretty excited about that, huh? That was pretty neat today. It's the first day we've seen her hee haw. Oh, yeah, she's and very She loud. has a set of lungs. She's like Godzilla. Very dignified hee haw. And mm -hmm. she laid down yesterday, which was exciting that uh, she's feeling comfortable enough to lay down. Ready? Oh, she's not square, so I'm going to put my hand on top of her shoulder here. With a little pressure, she'll move away from the pressure with that back leg. There you go. Good girl. Ready? Foot. Deep. Good job. Deep, 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 deep. Good girl. She stayed on her toe for a minute there. Mm -hmm. Or a few seconds would be more accurate. Nice work. Nice work. So names, we got Acerelda, call her Azzy for short. Brucella, because we know a really big moose that's name is Bruce the moose. And he was just, he was just a sweetheart. And what Honk other? the moose. Honk the moose is a book that I used like to read moose. to our daughter. My timer's going. So now my timer on my watch, it buzzes. I'm going to ask her now, even though it's buzzing. Ready? Vibrate is the right word I want. She's ready. Foot. There she goes. Deet, 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 deet. There she went off her toe. Very nice work. So honk the moose, Brucella, Acerelda, call her Azzy. Was there any other? That's it for now. Masakine, call her Maze. Oh, yeah, yeah, that could be a good one. Now, I don't know, I think I might just block her. You might not be able to see anything in the video. So I I'll think we should turn her, move her. her butt towards the camera. A little yeah, more. yeah. Come on, sweetie. Come on. Except, come on. Turn that big old butt. Turn that big old butt. There we go. There, that'll be good. We get her straight. Here we go. All right, so the back foot, we're going to start with the same thing. I'm going to start with my hand up on her rear, rub down, and then count from five down to one. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one, deep. And if they're really nervous about me doing that or I haven't done it before, I will do five through one or five through two, kind of up higher, and then do deet and let my hand go farther down on the last one did you see her flinch right there mm. yeah she i saw that <laughs> are you nervous huh? are you nervous yeah, she's gonna have fun with the walmart bags and a rope are you ready i'm gonna do that again the five four because she flinched five four three two one deet good girl Oh, and then I should set my timer. Ready? Foot. Deep. Good girl. Good job. There she flinched again. So she's getting used to our body language and how fast we move. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of newness.
Remember, they learn when you release the pressure. So letting her have some time just to chew on her oats, to sit there and absorb this is when she's going to learn what we're asking. It's not from saying good girl. They need the release of pressure. See, she stopped chewing when I petted her? Mm-hmm. Or are you done eating? Nope. <laughs> so her stopping eating is a nerve. She's just nervous. Are you ready? Ready? Foot deep. Good girl. Good girl. A lot more slower lifting them up. A lot less jerky than she was. Sure. That's a sign of her getting more comfortable. Mm -hmm. That's a good point, Dan. Mm hmm. But her reaction time isn't any quicker, but her movements are slower. You love donkey school lunch, huh? Yeah. They always do. We have two on the other side of the gate waiting. The other ones don't know what we're doing. Ready? Be cool if she left herself on the toe. Foot. My hand is just there. It's not. Ooh. She almost left herself on the toe. I think I forgot to say deep. She yeah, got Ready? Foot. There, good girl. Ba, deep, deep. She was on her toe for a second. Did she kick back or she just bring it up? No, oh, she just brought it up higher. Yeah, yesterday she was kicking back with a little ninja stuff. I was by myself. Well, I would say this is a very good session. So mm -hmm. today she will have had, what is it, 12 minutes or so? Or actually 17 is where we're at on the camera. 17 minutes of footwork. We will not do any more footwork with her today. Sometimes more is less. If we were out here for an hour, we would just overdose her with all of this and she would not absorb it and learn. So we might do some rope work. Which here's right how, now she's how jumpy she is. Ready? Hey, ready? You guys see her hunch up? She's like, what are you doing? Don't think that's a good idea. It's scary. Yeah. Pretty scary stuff, huh? It's a big old snake jumping on your back. Her backing up is a sign of being uncomfortable. I sniff this? Here. Give it a sniff. Pulling her head. She says she's uncomfortable. So there's a lot of things to work on, but right yep. now... Feet is their lifeline. That's what we want to get done first. We will incorporate other things in small amounts with her. Thanks for watching, guys.